Co-owner of Trois Mec, Petit Trois, and Trois Familia restaurants, restaurants, including the fried chicken hotspot Ludo Bird. Please welcome back to our kitchen, Chef Ludo Lefebvre. We love Merci you. Merci, David. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Merci for God being be. here. God be. So you are joining um, a long list of culinary heavyweights in season five of PBS's show Mind of a Chef. Correct. What sh What should we expect this season? What are you hoping to bring to the table? Uh, I hope to bring uh, some, uh, a lot of happiness, of course, and a lot of uh, heart of living in America. You know, as you know, in, Fran in France, uh, we don't work that much. <gasps> we drink, we, we eat, drink. and you we just, chocolate. you know, Why we, we have a lot of vacation. I love it, yeah. you know. You love I think, baguettes. Yeah, and we think we, we eat, we, uh, we, we work too much here in this country. Mm. So I always hear they saying uh, Europeans work to live Mm -hmm. We live to work. Americans yes, live correct. to work. Yeah. So you're trying to help us work to live. Yeah. I yeah. like yeah. that idea. Yeah. Oh, we should, sure, guys. No, definitely. Isn't that lovely? Yeah, that's so nice. <laughs> Look, everybody's very happy now. They all have I a smile. Know. I don't know. That, guys? that just hurt my head. But you know, <laughs> I'm just trying to figure that in out. In the show, I travel in France, Brittany, Paris, you know, and I also here in Los Angeles. You know. So Anthony Bourdain is the executive producer of this amazing voilà. series. You were friends with Anthony before? Yeah, and we get drunk together. <laughs> <laughs> that's and that's why you get nothing done. <laughs> right. Well, <laughs> he's narrating the season, the series. So I want to give our viewers a look at Let's see. at Ludo, at Chef Ludo, because we get Ludo. to know you pretty well. Take a look. <laughs> to be a chef in Los Angeles, you can really express yourself. People are very open. People come to try what you're doing. You have no excuse if you have nobody in your restaurant. You're doing something wrong. To cook what people like. I want to cook for people. French technique with Los Angeles culture on the plate. I can cook like this. Flying. We have an eruption. It's fried. It's good. It's good for hangover. <laughs> Nobody better escargot than me. I'm from Burgundy. Intense. Intense. <laughs> that was very intense. That's intense. <laughs> intense. It's very intense. I love that. What a great show. Okay, why don't you guys bring in, come on, yes. John, bring in the Why don't you? Ah, my favorite, guys. Oh. My favorite dish, lobster. Lobster thermidor. Thank lobster thermidor, guys. And you work too hard, by the way. Very easy to do. What is lobster thermidor? Because it does not look easy to do, chef. Yeah. Lobster thermidor yes. is a very classic uh, French recipe. You know, created a long time ago in just uh, uh, lobster meat with a white bechamel, mushroom, oh. mustard, mixed together, butter, breadcrumbs, in the oven, and voila, boom. Okay? Oh my God. Voila, boom. Mm. See you guys? Okay, okay so okay. let's get started. What do we do? So, mm. uh, lobster. I'm moving to France. Oh my God. Okay. okay. I'm going to go to the this. Oh, wow. Okay, oh, wow. What's the best way to get the lobster meat out so of look, the lobster? You go like this. Okay. Puff. Good knife, of course. Crack like this. Voilà. And after, voilà. See, it's very easy. Là, you take up the little caca. You know? Okay. You take the caca, guys, okay? So you see the lobster is cooked. Like, you boil the lobster, like, for, like, three or four minutes. That's it? That's it, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Keep in mind, you need to bake against the lobster. And after, you just take your finger like this and... Oh, my God. This is very easy. And what is that? Are you allowed to keep that, too? Yeah, it's good flavor, yes. Okay. Keep the shell. Chop your lobster. Okay, voilà, Debbie. Do you cook at home, Debbie? I do. Mm -hmm. I oui. cook a lot. I love so to voilà. cook. So, you see, you have lobster meat like this. After, you can take the... The claw. claw. So, it's close very easy to take up. You take this one like this. Up. Mm. Oh. You shake it. Voilà. And after, you take a knife like this and... Sorry, guys. Oh! And just... You take a little shower, you know? Have you done that? <laughs> Have you done that once or twice before? That's really, you know, guys, yeah. things happen. But after you just chop like this, voila, okay? After you take a little bowl, regarde, could regarde. you Could you cut the um, the claw the same way you did the body, or no? No, it's better like this, baby. Again, okay. look, regarde, That's regarde. That's idea. Take like this, guys. <laughs> That's what Mark says to me. Okay, you yeah. take the little, uh, la patte comme ça, you open it. Comme ça, okay. Voilà. Si. voilà. You shake it a little bit, shake it, shake it. Why? What's the shaking? After, but just make sure the cloud moving. You oh, get the, it to the bottom. Oh, thing. Okay. okay. And after you just go over there. Attention, Debbie. 
Oh, hop, hop. Et voilà. Oh, oh, wow. Wow. oh. Et voilà. See, it's very, wow. it's very easy, guys. You know, it's very easy. It's not difficult. Look at how easy we are. You know? right. How long have you been so... cooking, chef? Uh, now I'm 45, so I'm 45, so 30 years. Wow. wow. The time is fast, hein, guys. <laughs> <laughs> time yeah. is fast. Hein? So, voilà. Ça, you have lobster meat here. That's Then big. after, we have a little bit of a bechamel. So, bechamel is like a roux It's with beautiful. milk. You have mushroom, you have uh, mm. mustard, any flavor you want. You mix that together like this. Mm. Now, you, you have said this is, I understand this, is, you would say this is a traditional holiday dish? Yeah, because, you know, lobster in France is very expensive. Lobster is still very expensive, you know. Yeah. You don't eat that every day. So expensive thing, you know, is more like for celebration. Right. You know what I mean? Oh, We don't eat that every day, guys, you know? So yeah. in France, it's a very big deal to eat, uh, to eat lobster, you know? Here yeah. it is as well. You know what I mean? Is, I mean, I don't yeah, know here, but uh, in France, when you oh. say you eat lobster, people are like, oh! Wow, we have lobster. Maybe. So is lobster more expensive in France than it is here? Yes, because you know what? They're uh, better quality. Mm -hmm. Is it right, because... Is it you because can look on one uh, mine of the chef. I take you to Brittany and I show you how, why the lobster, the blue lobster in Brittany are better. Really? Ooh. Do they have yeah. a, a French accent, the lobster in French? Y yes, too, you know, and uh, yeah. <laughs> so you see, regarde, Debbie, you put him back, back here oh, like you this. Put you put it back you together. You put it back in the shell like this, you see? Oh, Debbie? that's why you have to be good at taking voilà. it apart. Mm -hmm. See, so, voilà, you put it over there. Okay, Debbie, oh. voilà. Wow, this is so, you know. Fantastic. What about the breadcrumbs? Then after Debbie, you can also, also use the head if you want for more, you know? Oh, my God. So, hop. Oh, Debbie, attention, Debbie, on va casser la tête. Okay, casser la tête. Right. That means to cut the head. Oh, oh my God. See, huh? Yeah. Why you speak French? You have a French uh, boyfriend? I've been speaking for 9 years. I'm going to go to the university. We're breaking the head. Hey, oh hey, I think she learned French from the pillow. No, we're not a French boyfriend. I've studied French for nine years. She learned French from the pillow, that's what we say, you know, in France. Did you have a little French boyfriend somewhere before, Debbie? No. Look, she's in red. She's very red. Pas un petit ami. We get you, Debbie. No, but it was before you married. It's not a problem, you know? There's nothing wrong with that, Debbie, right. okay? <laughs> nothing wrong with that, Debbie, so okay? French my French boyfriend was named Mrs. Nagel. She was my teacher. <laughs> so, so you put him back like this, okay? After you put some little breadcrumbs. Okay. Wow. Make crispy, voilà, comme ça. Un petit oh. peu I love ça. how nobody is talking at the time. Not one person. Hey, guys, you're not very helpful. Like <laughs> yes. okay? And now it goes um, in the oven? Oh, but attends, attends, attends. Je vais te dire, un tout petit peu de beurre. Oh. Un tout petit peu de butter, okay? Just to make shiny. Like oh. the, the butter is oh. going to make the breadcrumbs very, very, very uh, moist. Uh, moist, crispy, oh. and, uh, and a nice coloration. And butter is good with lobster. Oui. Yeah. Butter is good with yeah. everything. Oh. Everything is good with oh. butter. Nice glass of wine. Voilà. Oh. Oh. So how yeah. long do we put it in the oven? So uh, when it's black, it's cooked. So until it's black. No, we say five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> five minutes. That's the way voilà. I... Five minutes, get over there, in the oven. Close. And now, <laughs> on reprend. <laughs> on <laughs> Et voilà, Debbie. Wow. Wow. A little bit of stuff for Debbie. Debbie, 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 Debbie. Debbie. We're going to go, go away. Debbie's going to have a good bite of that and tell you what it's like when we come back.